Welcome to beautiful Eugene Stone Stadium here on Furman University's campus where today we'll be having another episode of Furman's Wide World of Sports. Today some of your better known soccer players will be competing in three different competitions to show who's got the most soccer prowess. Let's meet our contestants. Hold on, wait. Our first contestant is a two-year All-American standout on the Furman University soccer team Clint Dempsey Doodle! Look at those feet. Our second contestant, a freshman, is the second leading high school scorer in Georgia high school soccer history, Richie Craven Mellon! He's got some fancy feet, doesn't he folks? Our third contestant is going to be showing us some of those Caribbean styles from the under 20 national team of Trinidad and Tobago and a Furman soccer standout freshman Rhett don't call me Father Abraham good luck Rhett last but certainly not least a participant in intramural rec soccer Trey Sweetfeet Sullivan unbelievable Okay, here we go. Our contestants are ready to show their soccer prowess with the first competition juggling for juggling as long as they can go. On your marks, get set, go! And there they go. Alright folks, 30 minutes of a lapse here at Eugene Stone Soccer Stadium. They're still going. Here we go. Richie Craven looking strong. Red Abraham, still going. Clint Dempsey, easy. <laughs> Trey Sullivan, <laughs> looking great. Looking great. <laughs> All right, Clint Dempsey, feeling a little tired. Oh, and it drops. It drops, and Dempsey's out of the competition. Let's go over to Abraham. Looking good, but maybe tiring a bit. He's juggled over 4,000. Oh, it just gets away from him. And here's Richie Craven. Can he do it? Second to last here. And Richie, far over. Can he keep the ball? No! A big touch and he can't get there. And Trey Sullivan. He's the last competitor, ladies and gentlemen. There it is. There it is. With 6,580 juggles, Trey Sullivan is the winner of the first competition. Trey won. Other competitors, zero. Sweet feet, Sullivan. We'd like to introduce you folks to our judge, Charlie Brooks. He's going to be judging this next competition, which is the fancy trick competition. It's pretty much subjective, and Charlie's opinion is what counts. He's tough as nails, so let's see how it pans out. All right, first contestant, first trick is going to be Red Abraham. Let's see what he's got. Here we go. That was fancy. Let's see what the judges give him. What's that score? 8.5. 8.5. Nice job, Rhett. All right, our second contestant, Richie Craven. Show us those fancy feet on your first trick. Wow. Judge, 9.0 from Charlie Brooks. What a trick. Let's see what Red Abraham thinks about that score. Cheating, move on. Cheating. He's not happy. Our third contestant on... All right, folks, our third contestant is going to be Clint Dempsey. Let's see if he can best Richie Craven. A real tandem of tricks there. Fancy combo. Let's see if the judge took to it. A 7.0! Looks like Charlie Brooks might have it out for Clint Dempsey. Let's see Clint's reaction. It's all to the good, baby. I do it for the kids. Do it for the kids. Last contestant, Trey Sweetfeet Sullivan. The score to beat is a 9.0. Let's see what he's got. Going with the head ball. Wow! An unbelievable header from Trey Sullivan. Let's see what Charlie says. A 10! A perfect 10! Like Nadia Komenich and Trey Sullivan is going crazy. He's up 2 0 0 0. Moving into the third tripled competition. Our third and final competition is going to be the scissors or bicycle kick competition. Trying to take a volley from the air and put it in the goal. This is going to take some amazing concentration and feet. Here we go, Clint Dempsey, our first competitor. Yeah. 
First attempt unsuccessful. Let's see what the second attempt draws. What the He's got to get a good volley. Richie Craven struggling with the crosses, but that's not part of the competition. So he's immune to any sort of judging. No, Dempsey's got to get a perfect ball, apparently. God, if you want to look good for the camera. <laughs> Wow! <laughs> for the kids, baby. Like Marcella Balboa, he does it for the kids. Charlie Brooks giving the nine and the nod. Dempsey showing some great skill. Let's go to our second competitor. Well, the second scheduled contestant was Red Abraham, but apparently he's quite dejected after the apparent cheating and scoring as he claims Charlie Brooks is biased. And he's walking away. Also, the dining hall is about to close. Well, our next competitor will be Richie Craven. Richie Craven. Oh. Off the crossbar, but a valiant effort from Richie Craven on the scissors kick. Let's see what the judges give him. 8.5. A good score considering it didn't go in the goal. Charlie Brooks, Brooks apparently impressed with the effort. A gutsy performance from Richie Craven. Let's see what Trey Sweetfeet Sullivan's got to offer us now. Yeah, get out of the goal. Clint Dempsey coming in for the cross. Wow! Fancy stuff from Trey Sullivan who's in the back of the goal, shouldering it in, spinning around, great celebration, Charlie Brooks. Another 10 for Trey Sullivan! Unbelievable, folks! Yes! Yes, and he has demolished the competition here with an absolute myriad of tens, just destroying everyone. Let's see how they react, respond in the closing ceremonies. Well, folks, the dejected bronze and silver medalists look on in disgust as Trey Sullivan, Sweet Feet Sullivan, basks in the glory of an absolute demolishing victory over the Furman team. He can't wait till wreck intramurals next year, and neither can we. As the night weans on, we say thank you and good night from Furman's wild world of sports.